was a time, I suspect, when men and women could give a fully human response to any situation, when we could be fully absorbed in the world as human beings. But more often now, people don't get to see the whole situation, but only some small part of it. There's a division of labor, and people carry out small, narrow, specialized jobs, and we can't act without some sort of direction from on high. I call this the agentic state. The individual yields to authority, and in doing so, becomes alienated from his own actions. Mr. Dalquist, you agree to the rules? The agentic state is store policy. It's, I'm just doing my job. Or, that's not my job. Or, I don't make the rules. We don't do that here. Just following orders. It's the law. In the agentic state, the individual defines himself as an instrument carrying out the wishes of others. A soldier, a nurse, an administrator, an actor, a corporate employee, or even, yes, academics and artists. A person has a choice. He or she chooses to become agentic. But once you assume the role, it's almost impossible to go back. 